This Dutch singer is the original YouTube sensation, being discovered and signed by Justin Timberlake after posting videos online. Hi, I'm Rebecca Brayton and welcome to WatchMojo.com and today we're speaking with Esme Denters. So for those of us who may not know the story of how you got discovered, why don't you tell us that? I actually discovered YouTube, which you know I thought was great. People can post their own videos. And I was really excited about it and I was like, okay. My sister had this like really old webcam and so that's why I decided to put up just a couple of cover songs. Just because I wanted to know what people thought of my voice. Standing in the front yard telling me how I'm such a fool. All of a sudden it became very popular with millions of views and um, I was just in my bedroom going like, wow, this is insane. And I took my bag and I went over to the US to meet with some of the labels. And actually one of those labels happened to be Justin Timberlake's label, Tenman Records. So I'm really, really proud to say that, you know, I'm the first artist on his record label. When did you first start singing? You know, my dad used to have a lot of different records around, anything from Stevie Wonders to the Beatles, and I used to do ballet with my sister, so music was just always around, and I just always wanted to become an artist. I remember watching the Spice Girls and Janet Jackson and Destiny's Child and just wanting to be, you know, an artist like them. You changed up your makeup, your DNA. How do you think you've grown as an artist since you started posting videos? Honestly, I've never had to sing in bars or do all that stuff that a lot of artists usually do. Basically, what happened to me, which was incredible, that I got to do all these massive things. You know, I got to be on Oprah all of a sudden. I got to do the pre-show for Justin all of a sudden. Well, I'd never performed before. You know, it's a lot of pressure, and I definitely think that that was the best learning experience for me. It's just being thrown out there and just having to do it. You're interested in the songwriting process as well? Yes, definitely. For me, it's just really like therapy. I love to write, I love to come up with melodies, and it's, you know, some people like painting, and I love writing songs, and it's just an outlet for me. Now, you've already toured with some heavy hitters, as you mentioned. What have you been able to pick up from, you know, the Enrique Iglesias and the Justin Timberlakes? There's so much to learn from, and especially energy. Like, Enrique's energy, I felt like he was really, really connected towards the crowd, so that's what I learned from them. You know, Neo is an incredible songwriter, and all of them just have these, you know, qualities that, you know, I want to have all of them, so I try and learn from it. What would you say is the best part of your newfound career? Probably the best part is just having made a record and, and being able to perform that in front of people and just having those fans that I started with on YouTube and having them come see me at one of the shows, it just, you know, it just means so much to me. Thanks so much. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Thank you. Get me out of here.